if you really mean it when you say, Not my will be done, but your will be done, Lord. If you really mean it, you would seek him for the answer. You would not base his will on what you think you should be doing or what you want to do. You would seek him for an answer. You would seek him day and night. That would be how bad you want to know his will. Because it would be a sad thing to die and never have known the will that God has for your life. Never have known the purpose that God put you on this earth. So seek the Lord while he may be found. Call upon him while he is near. Ask God to reveal unto you his will for your life. Ask him to reveal it to you, to show you. He will give you the answer. It may be in a dream. It may be in a vision. It may be audible. But if you seek him, honestly seek him, he will give you an answer. Be patient and wait for the answer. I pray that the eyes of your understanding be enlightened. That you may know what is the hope of his calling. The Lord is good to them that wait for him. To the soul that seek him. He also may reveal your purpose through his word or through a prophet. Let God be God. Do not be conformed to this world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind, that you may prove what is that good and acceptable and perfect will of God. Present your body a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable unto God. If you be risen with Christ, seek those things which are above, where Christ sits on the right hand of God. Set your affection on things above and not on things on the earth. You will regret not knowing God's will for you. It Things will not fit until you step in to His will for your life. Call upon Him. Wait for His answer. He also may send an angel to give you your purpose. However he speaks, let God be God. Honey, sweetheart, you will never be satisfied until you step in to the purpose God has created you for. God will equip you with everything you need to carry out his will. So be filled with the fullness of God through Christ Jesus. And we know that God is able to do exceedingly 
abundantly above all that we could ask or think according to the power that works in us. And we know that all things work together for good to them that love God, to them who are called according to his purpose.